I'm going to show you how easy it is to add an email one-touch address to a BizHub 4 Series copier. The first thing you want to do is go into menu, then press utility, and choose number one, one-touch user box registration, create one-touch destination, choose address book public, and choose email. So you will hit utility, then the number one, four times. Now, you should see the emails that are already in the machine, if there are any. To add a new one, click new at the bottom of the screen, touch name, and enter the person's name using the QWERTY keyboard you have there on the screen. To get capital letters, hit shift. I'm going to enter Jane Doe here, so I hit shift and capital J. Hit shift again to get lowercase, and I'm spelling out Jane. I'm going to hit space to enter our last name. You don't have to do this, but you can. So I'm entering Jane Doe. And OK. The sort character is there. Index will alphabetize Jane because our first letter, the first letter in names begin with J. So I'm adding her to my favorites as well. And hit OK. Now to scroll to page 2 and enter an email address. So simply touch email address on the screen and use the credit keyboard and type in her email address which will be jane.doe Hit my shift key to get my at symbol and shift again to get back to my lowercase letters and enter the domain name or your email address. I'm just putting in mycompany.com just for a sample here. And simple enough and press OK. So I have all of my information in now. Check the spelling of the email address and press OK. Now you should notice you should have another entry there for Jane Doe. Now I'm done with that so I will hit close, 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 close four times or five times to get back to the main screen and now when I go into scan mode I have another entry named Jane Doe and she is on my favorite screen. I will select her name. She shows in the destination so I place my document face up on the document feeder or face down on the glass and simply press the start button and you should now have a new email attachment going to Jane Doe.